A top story on KCAL 9 News at noon today, touchdown success. NASA's Mars rover InSight successfully landed on the red planet. It happened just a few moments ago. KCAL 9's Cara Finstrom is live at the Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena with a lot of excited people. And what's next, Cara? Relay communication Wow, lots of excitement here. And behind us, you can see some of the scientists that are in the Jet Propulsion Lab's mission control. They have been just cheering, uh, patting each other on the back, so excited about this landing. Let's show you an image that they just put up seconds ago of the surface of Mars. Pretty incredible. This was just beamed back. Uh, initially, we heard a lot of excitement uh, as landing was confirmed of this uh, space. Craft uh, just a few minutes beforehand, and then this image came across. Let's go to the reaction in Mission Control. Touchdown confirmed. Inside is on the surface of Mars. During the last six and a half months, InSight has traveled across nearly 300 million miles of space. Everything rode today on what engineers call the seven minutes of terror. That's the time between the spacecraft's entry into the Martian atmosphere at more than 12,000 miles per hour and its landing at zero. We spoke with an engineer about the challenges the vessel faced. At about a mile above the surface of Mars, the lander falls away from the back show and lights its engines. And very quickly, the vehicle must rotate out of the way so that the parachute and the back show doesn't come down to hit it. The last thing that has to happen is that on the moment of contact, the engines have to shut down immediately. If they don't, the vehicle will tip over. So if all the steps of entry, descent, and landing happen perfectly and we are safely on the surface of Mars, we'll be ready to do some exciting new science. And that's exactly where we are now. You can see some of those scientists huddled again over in mission control. Lots of excitement about what comes next. This is a mission that is focused on learning more about the interior of Mars and what it can teach us about the origins of Earth. So uh, lots of exciting stuff to come during the next two years as this uh, mission gets underway. Sandy? Oh, Cara, what, what excitement out there and good for them.